this is the answer to the question nobody was asking basically what happens when you mix dampers so in this car I've just fitted original re equipment replacement dampers on the front and we're still using Bilstein P8 sport dampers at the rear so I just want to I wanted to find out you know what effect that has on you know the handling of the car the balance of the car is it a good thing are there any positives with it um, is it dangerous etc etc so my findings so far the most obvious thing is it feels like there is definitely less grip at the front than there was before so with coilovers maybe I would soften the front more than the rear to get a bit more turn in and I suppose you as you'd expect it takes a bit longer it takes a bit longer for the front of the the chassis to settle it's really hard for me to say if the grip is actually less or it just feels less I can hear the inside wheel look at the speed this truck's coming down here so you can hear the tires squealing which is something that never ever 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 happened with the sport dampers we just come through this quick left right here what does it feel like because normally this is a pretty much a non-issue yeah definitely more understeer alarmingly so and it seems to be when you first turn in on corner entry is when it's worst I've got a lot less confidence in the car with a with a Bilstein V8 unlimited confidence basically because I always knew I was always confident the car was going to turn in it would never understeer and if it oversteered you could always it's a front wheel drive car can correct that with power so that was never an issue I would much prefer a front wheel car oversteer than understeered you know uh, and when you're pushing on it's, I feel like it's sliding across the road, the front axle. Now how much of this would be down to the mismatch of the dampers? I think maybe if the dampers, if I had the Kyabra on the front and the rear, maybe that would restore the balance because we've got the suspension moving the same amount front and rear. There's definitely more roll with the KYB now. So this is um, like this, it's strange. Maybe there is more grip, but you've just got to push more grip than what I think. You've just got to push through that initial understeer. So we'll just have a, a quick run back up. But it's just the corner entry is horrible. You know, a good 20% of the corner, maybe 30% of the corner for it to start tracking. For the first 30%, it, fe it feels like it's washing straight on. I mean, look at the speed this truck is going down this road. I don't think there's any any benefit in running, mixing dampers across the axle. This is the answer to the question nobody was asking, basically. So that's the video, guys. Thank you for watching. Uh, look after yourself, and I'll see you again in the next video. Please forgive.